Um, good afternoon. Could you please introduce yourself? Okay. I'm Aris de Jong. I'm working at the Netherlands Embassy here in Al Zalwa. And I'm uh, working with development cooperation in the area of health, HIV AIDS, nutrition and WASH. Um, why is monitoring important for you? Monitoring is important for the Embassy to make uh, clear that uh, the programs that we are supporting do have the results that we are expecting. Uh, and I think it's important to uh, make this clear also to the Dutch population uh, that, uh, that we have results, but not only for the Dutch population, I think it's also important for the Ethiopian uh, players to make sure that uh, what we are supporting gives also results for them. Okay. Could you please give some, a few examples of how monitoring has been used at the embassy or how you are monitoring at the moment? Uh, there is uh, an annual exercise whereby we, the results of our programs are translated in indicators and uh, that goes to The Hague uh, and the Ministry puts it all together and uh, in the end it's uh, reported to the Tweede uh, Kamer, uh, to our Parliament. I mean that's the, the Dutch part of it. Uh, of course uh, we don't wait for one year, we get uh, twice uh, per year a report from our implementing partners and uh, we see if the progress is good, if the progress is not good, we try to identify together uh, where the problems are and what could be uh, changed to uh, improve the implementation of the program. And the things we are looking at uh, is uh, in particular the number of uh, water points that are being established, the functionality of the water points, uh, the number of households that have latrines uh, or the number of villages that have uh, that are defecation, uh, free defecation, free, what is it? Open defecation, Open defecation free. free. Yeah, sorry, yes. Yeah. Um, we try to look at uh, uh, the gender aspects in the sense of uh, what does it mean for uh, the women. Uh, as you know, that uh, water is very much the, uh, the, the duty of the task of women in this country. And we're also trying to look at uh, what it means for uh, the women if their water is more available. Uh, no, and how they are involved also in the, the management processes of the water sector. Okay. And finally, how would you like to see monitoring take place in the future? What's your ideal for monitoring? I think there's a, there's a lot of new technology that would make monitoring uh, much more uh, practical, much more timely, um, and much more interesting. Uh, so I'm looking forward to the technological uh, innovations for uh, uh, for water wash, and as we just discussed, I think there is uh, there is more to to wash than uh, just drinking water. Uh, in Ethiopia, we are looking also at the multiple use of services, both for uh, water and for sanitation. And I think it will be interesting to monitor also the link with food security and um, with nu nutrition, also with health. Okay, thank you very much. Okay.